Uh, hello YouTube and fellow Radio Hams, just want to uh, show you this little uh, project I've just finished assembling. This is an MMDVM uh, hotspot, uh, making use of the special firmware that Andy uh, CA6JU developed for the uh, STM32 uh, microcontroller. I suppose you could consider this to be a bit like an Arduino. Uses these uh, these modems. These are the uh, uh, ADF7021 SE uh, modem boards that you can uh, you can buy on the internet. This is a a uh, sort of general purpose modem that can do various different um, modes uh, and in combination with MMDVM host Jonathan Naylor G4K Alexis software. This is uh, this is a full duplex hotspot. Why? What's the benefit of it? Well, for DMR, it's a huge benefit because we've got the two time slots, so we can have something on time slot one, static links, talk groups, and on time slot two, we can have a reflector, and we can just literally just change channel on the radio. Or you can have two radios on. You can have one radio monitoring say reflector 4426 which is uh, linked to the hubnet system in the UK and on uh, time slot 1 you could have a static link of say 4420 the northwest link for instance this this modem will also do or this board will also do p25 fusion and d star as well uh, as you can see here of this a bank of leds that show you the status i've only put on a few of the LEDs because I'm too tight fisted to waste the resistors and the LEDs. I put the Carrier Sense PTT, a DMR, this is a blue LED, and a Power On LED here as well, so you can see which mode it's in and whether it's receiving and transmitting. Uh, the PCB was laid out by EA7GIB, and you can get the gerber files uh, from um, the MMDVM. Um, Yahoo groups. Uh, these ones, were, this was made. This, these boards uh, were made by Dirty PCBs. And there's a few passive components on it. There's a voltage, 3.3 volts voltage regulator, and some filtering in there. So there's a couple of capacitors and uh, an inductor and a 3.3 regu uh, volt regulator. So basically, so these uh, two modem boards get a nice clean supply. I've got this one running at nine megs duplex shift. And even just lashed up like this, I can get around the house on it. I've got a, another aerial, just a little Chinese mag mount aerial for 70 cents. And I'll just get the uh, transmit and receive aerial. But it certainly works all the way down to the kitchen at the back of the house, which is fine. It's all I'm really going to use it for. So there you go. It's a little project you can uh, stick together if you're into MMDVM projects. And have your own little personal two time slot repeater if you're into uh, DMR around the house. And all the parts are readily available. Of course, you can get the modem firmware uh, for this from the GitHub. And all the details are on there how to, to make these as well. So I hope you've enjoyed watching.